hello everybody welcome back to my youtube channel my name is precious doy and in this video i'm going to show you how to draft a princess that bustier pattern so you need your basic bodies front and back i have a video on how to draft a basic bodies pattern i'll link it in the description box and you need to trace your front bodies on another piece of paper Okay, now you need to draw a line at the underboss. You can measure it on yourself or on your client from your under uh, from your nipple point to your underboss. So you draw a line at your underboss. So after drawing the line across, now you are going to draw your style line for your princess that you are going to draw the line from your from your arm all to the boss points. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you can see more sewing tutorials and how to cut your dresses so you can see more videos. Yeah, I clean off the line that I drew for the princess that and I'm redrawing it. I'm adjusting the line. Now you go back to your under bust. Near the dart, you will take half inch on both sides. After the dart, you will take half inch on both sides. So after taking half inch on both sides of the dart and the underboss, now you connect it back to the waist. You will connect it back to the waist. Now after connecting it to the waist, you have to con you have to also connect it to the boss point. So you connect it at both sides. Connect it on the other side also. Okay, and that thing is you don't want this side to be too curvy. So, you don't want this side to be too curvy. Now I number it one and two. The one we place on fold, that is when you are cutting it on fabric, but not yet. And the second one, with the two, the one that I number as two, will be, will, will be cut out. You cut two out of fabric. Now I'm cutting out the pattern. Okay, some of you might be wondering, how do I adjust this size for a bigger bust? I'm going to, I'm going to show you that in a bit. I'll show you how to make it big, how to make the bust bigger for a bigger size. For a bigger size of busts. Okay, now you want to cut out the dart at the bust. You see that dart at the side that I'm cutting out? Now you want to cut it just one side like that. So after cutting it, you place it on the other side like so. You see the way I place my own? Now you are going to tape it up. You have to close that part up to make the bust area, to, to make it bigger. So you have to close it up. You have to close the dart up. If you watch my video on how to draft a basic bodice pattern, you will see how I created the dart. You will see and how I created the board, basic bodies, how I draft the basic bodies, you will see it there. So now after I have closed up the dart, that closed. So I have closed up the dart. Please, this part is very important, so you have to note it. If you haven't subscribed yet and you are still watching this video, subscribe now. Smash that subscribe button.
<laughs> the shape is coming out already it is looking good already it is looking like the bustier pattern already but for a bigger bust now you draw a line you will find another piece of paper draw a line at the at the you that line that you draw you are going to match it to the under bust of your pattern So after you match it up, you, are, you will trace it. You will trace your basic bodies. You will trace the one that I name that I number as one. You will trace it. So after tracing it, you will remove it. You will place the side, the front, um, the side fronts. You will place that match it up at the under boss. Make sure the under boss line is matching up with the line that you drew on the paper earlier. So now you are going to trace this center, the side front. Sorry, you are going to trace it also. Okay, now so I've traced it and mind you you have to lose space between the center front and the side front There has to be space between them because you want to make all use of the space You can leave like a lot of gap between them because you have to make use of it As you see my own there's space now at the boss point. I will go out by one inch You can make your 0 0.75 or one inch so you go out one inch at the bust point of the side front piece and you will now use your curve like the way i'm doing right now you use your curve to connect it yeah i later reduce the it i reduce it to 0 0.75 that is three quarter so and now i'm going to connect it back I'll connect that point that I just made to my under bust. Okay. So after connecting it, I will also connect it at the top. I'll connect it at the top like so. Okay, now you will extend it out at the arm o side. You will extend the side front out by half inch and connect it back to the side like the way you are seeing it right now. Now clean the former curve that is there because we have a new curve now. So you can clean the former one off to avoid confusion. You can clean it off. We number it, number it again. Now feel free to cut it out. Your patterns are ready. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Don't forget and click the like button, like this video so it can reach more people, so more people can learn from this video. Like this video and subscribe, please. Please, thank you. Now you are going to cut out your patterns. Your patterns are almost ready, ready, ready. So this is what we have right now. The pattern is com the pattern is complete, and you you also need the back pattern also. But this is the front, and I have shown you how to draft a princess that bustier. So what you need to do now is to add the seam allowance. You can even add the seam allowance while cutting it out on fabric. You can place it directly as you've done it now. Place it on your fabric, then cut it out one the one that i number as one you will cut it on fold 
and the second part that a number that's two you will cut out two out of fabric i hope you get the point that i'm trying to bring out so this is simply it simple very simple very easy very straightforward if you try this pattern let me know and if this video has been helpful please subscribe thanks for watching till the end so